Welcome to Forest Pro. In this short tutorial we'll be looking at the new leaf editor which appeared in version 1.11 of Forrester Pro and allows you to produce much better optimized leaf meshes for your models. And for this tutorial we'll be just using the apple tree model and if we have a look at the actual leaf meshes by switching to the wireframe view we can see that the meshes are large leaves, they're, they're squares and that makes them perfect for swapping textures. However, if we wish, we can optimize these leaf meshes by reducing the area of alpha transparency, which is rather computationally expensive. And we can do this from the leaf editor. So we go to the leaf library and press new, and this shows us the leaf editor. And as before, we can just import leaf meshes from collider files. Um, we can rotate those meshes um, so they're in the correct orientation to a branch and even add textures to the mesh um, and use the new UV view option which allows us to change the UV coordinates. We've also added a new way for you to create your own custom leaf meshes directly from textures. So if we go back to the leaf library and press new to pull up the leaf editor and select texture so we open up a, a, a texture and go to UV view then we can add vertices directly onto the UV view by left clicking and holding down the shift button and that allows us to create a leaf mesh which is very close to the texture to minimize the amount of transparency and if we select three vertices and press the F button then that will create us a face so although this, this model now has more vertices, more polys, because we've reduced the amount of alpha mapping on some modern game engines, that will produce a performance boost. And we can now convert our new mesh into a 3D mesh using POS to UV. We can then change the leaf mesh in 3D view. So we, for example, we can flip the normals, or we could select vertices and hold down either the X, Y, and Z key and do mouse drag and actually move those vertices around. But for now we'll just save this leaf mesh and apply it to our tree. So we open up the tree library, select our tree model and go to the leaf properties and we can swap the leaf mesh for that new mesh that we've just created. And now we can just create that tree model with the new custom leaf mesh. Forrester Pro's new leaf editor then allows you to do some quite advanced optimization to improve the performance of tree models within UDK, Unity, and Talk3D.